It was a very long flight, but I'm finally here. I have been waiting for this moment. It's been one year since I don't see my son. He went to college and he's living in a house. He must be really tall now. I'm looking forward to see him and hug him. I can't wait for that. I have been working a lot this year, so I can help him with whatever he needs now. I can't wait to see him. I've just arrived and got off the plane and I'm so excited to see him. I'm going to call him so he can guide me to his home. I don't know this city very well. Oh, it's my mom. I've been waiting for her call the whole day. Finally. Hello, mom? Yeah, I've been waiting for your call. Yeah, I'm here in my house. What? You've been traveling for more than 12 hours? Wow, that's a lot of time for a flight. No, no, I haven't been doing much. I've been waiting for you, so I'm not planning to go out. Seriously? But I sent you the address yesterday. Oh, you don't know how to get here. Alright, don't worry. When you're near here in town, call me and I will pick you up, okay? Great. No, I haven't been cooking anything because I didn't go to the supermarket this week. Don't worry, the important is you to arrive here well. Then we'll see what to eat. Alright. Yeah, just call me, okay? Okay. I love you, mom. I've been walking for more than 20 minutes. This must be the town, or not? Maybe I need to check the address again. Happily, I bought a map in the airport. Alright, my son has been telling me how to get to his home for about one week. I don't understand very well this map. He's been explaining to me over and over again. Okay, I've been walking this street straight ahead, then I turn left and then right. Mm. Mm, well, <laughs> I think I'm lost. I need to call my son so he can pick me up. Hello, mom? What? You've been walking for 20 minutes? But I told you to call me when you get in the city. Alright. I'll pick you up, okay? Wait for me. Thank you, Chris. I've been trying to arrive here by my own, but I got lost. Sorry. You didn't need to do that. You have been flying for many hours. You must be tired, mom. I just wanted to give you a good surprise. But anyway, how have you been, Chris? I'm great, mom. I have been studying hard these weeks. My final exams are next week. Oh, that's great. Have you been getting good grades lately? I mean, at college? Of course, mom. I have a scholarship, so I need to get excellent grades at college. Very good, my son. But have you been eating healthy food? I see you thinner than before. <laughs> I'm fine, mom. 
I've been preparing my meals here at home. Hmm, well, if you say so. What have you been cooking every day? Well, you know I love chicken, so I've been eating a lot of chicken every day. Fried, baked. Haven't you been eating any vegetables with that chicken? Vegetables are important to be healthy. Of course, mom. Although I don't like vegetables, I've been baking them. Very good. And tell me, what have you been doing lately? I want to know. Well, I have been studying hard. Also, I've been learning how to play the guitar. The guitar? I love it! Who has been teaching you how to play it? Some friends and I have been going to guitar lessons near the college. We pay for it together. Very well! Have you and your friends been going to parties? Tell me the truth. To be honest, yeah, we've been going to parties lately. I can't lie to you, mom. I knew it, but that's normal. You haven't been drinking alcohol, have you? No, mom. You know I don't like alcohol, but I've been dancing a lot. <laughs> of course you have. I know you love dancing. Who do you dance with? Any special girl? Mm, well, I've been dating a girl. I met her in one of these parties, mom. Oh, that's a surprise. Tell me more about her. I want to know everything, okay? Well, she's been going to the same class as me. I liked her since the first time I saw her. Oh, you both have been studying together all this time, then? Yeah, she's been getting better grades than I have. She's a very smart girl. You love her. I'm sure about that. Then, you've been going to parties together too? Does she drink alcohol? No, mom. She doesn't like it either. She's been going to the gym for one year. Excellent. I had told you before, you need to go to the gym to work out. I haven't been going because I don't have much time, but I will go next year, I promise. Alright, and what have you been doing together lately? Going to the movies? We've been visiting her mom and her grandmom. I already know her family, and they are nice people. But we have been talking by phone all this time, and you didn't tell me anything. Why? I've been thinking about telling you about that, I promise. But I wanted to tell you this face to face. Anyway, the important thing here is that you are happy, and I'm happy for you. Thank you, mom. Now, why don't we eat something, or maybe you're not hungry? I'm starving. I've been walking and traveling a lot. I need to eat something. <laughs> I suppose so. Don't worry, I have been waiting for you to eat. Why don't we go out? That's a good idea. 
Do you know any good restaurant near here? Oh, of course you know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just let me bring my wallet and we leave. Sure, I'm so happy to see you. I can't wait to meet your girlfriend. <laughs> Relax, we will have time for everything. I'm happy you're here. And I'm happy to be here. I miss you so much. I love you, my son. I love you so much. Yeah, I know. I love you too, mom. I love you so much. I hope you liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. And if you want to support this channel, you can join us or click on the super thanks button. Thank you very much for your support. Take care.